Hey guys, Billy Davidson here with Davidson First Wash Painting, Hammond, Louisiana. We uh, we out here working in the uh, pouring rain, middle of the night. It's 2.13 a.m. Um, we've had a little storm move across the Gulf of Mexico and push right on into Louisiana. And it's giving us heck right in the middle of uh, one of our major, major jobs of the year, actually. So we're getting this taken care of. Uh, you know, needless to say, sometimes you have to go still go at it even though the weather is not cooperating perfect um so we, we stay busy extremely busy uh sometimes daytime and nighttime crew for weeks and weeks and weeks on end before we even get a breather um if you'd like to know how we do that check out the link in the resource page um i'll leave that link in the description also i'll pin a comment got a bunch of helpful information in there kind of let you know how we do what we do here uh, very low advertising costs, uh, like zero. <laughs> so, I, I mean, I would say zero. I do spend a few dollars here and there. Um, it's on marketing materials. So anyway, we messing with this metal building, man. This thing is a beast. And um, we had an RV place, and this is the shop, and we are uh, kind of working in the dark out here, but it's just enough light to see. Now, what we did do... And this uh, one of my main topics of this uh, this video here is if you know you're gonna have to do a building at nighttime, which we knew this we knew this three weeks ago even well, I would say two weeks ago um, we knew we were gonna be doing this wall at nighttime tonight. That's how the schedule was ran. I had planned the schedule out for weeks in advance, so we're still right on schedule. We within an hour of our schedule being two even two weeks off. So. A lot of planning goes into running these crews, daytime and nighttime. But uh, it's I like it. It's my passion. So um, and it pays a crazy amount of money. So you know what's what's not to love about that. But in need to say it is raining. Now the only way we wouldn't have been out here is if it was something really serious. Lightning also would stop us. But getting back to my point, if you know you're going to be doing something at night, it is upon your shoulders and your responsibility to go by there during the daytime. And take this very beautiful phone that you're probably holding in your hand right now and take video footage of this in the daytime, which we did that. And we already marked out and mapped out our spots that we knew were going to give us trouble. So we knew above these lights right here, it's going to be hard to see that gutter line up into that light, if you will. You know, I mean, you can hold your hand in front of it and try to reduce some of the glare. So we knew above what light number three coming down from the corner was gonna probably have to get a step ladder up there or, or either hit it with x jet or do a little bit stronger solution with the soft wash pump so we mapped this place out because we knew we was gonna have to come in here at nighttime and reason why we're gonna come in here at nighttime because in the daytime these doors are open and these uh people are, are moving hundreds of thousands of dollars a day i'm sure in service tickets so they're not going to be too happy about it we coming in here closing down there their uh, doors and um, you know they can't get their uh, equipment in and out to, to work on stuff and all that so night the only way we could do it so again we went in mapped it all out we knew what spots that were going to give us trouble um, we knew what spots that were going to be easy and now we're executing so think about that guys if you are doing nighttime work and the lighting is not ideal go to, in the daytime make good footage of it um, let your crew see it send that footage to every crew guy let them know hey we're going to be here tonight such such date such such time make yourself familiar with this building because when you do get out here at night like i said you can't see all that great but you got that footage now what we're doing we're going back and still looking at the footage as we go from door to door to door we looking at the daytime footage so just a little tip and trick to help you out on your next pressure washer job again i am billy davidson here with davidson pressure washer painting and I hope to see you in the next video.